Hi everyone, today we're going to go through on how to use your sleep ring in order to do your exit sleep study. Um, so the first thing is you're going to put in your patient ID and you should be getting this patient ID through email. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and put that there. And then the next thing you'll do is you'll put your date of birth in. Click OK and then go ahead and sign in and then make sure you have your ring nearby so it can go ahead and connect it, uh, to it and make sure your Bluetooth is on. You're going to see your recorder. Um, it's going to be that number right there and you're just going to go ahead and connect it. And just go ahead and start recording whenever you're ready to go to sleep just by hitting this play button down at the bottom. And it's going to ask um, your signed in. That's your patient ID. You're going to go ahead and click yes. And just give it a minute in order for it to start searching your information. Alrighty, so our information is there and our recording is in process. And you're just going to leave your phone. You can go ahead and turn it off. Um, not all the way, but just so where your screen isn't on. Um, and just record yourself um, whenever you're going to sleep. And once you wake up, go ahead and stop this. And would you like to stop the recording? Yes. And at the very bottom, you're going to go to that middle section and it's going to tell you um, your patient ID number. And it's going to have the time that you started, ended, and then it's going to show upload status completed. Make sure it shows completed so you'll have to keep your ring.